side. We're gonna select the language a little bit later on, not from the administrator, because maybe you will decide to add the language a bit later. So I think it's better if we see it all at a later stage. So we're gonna use WAMP to do this simple task. So we don't want any kind of content. So I'll just go ahead and create. Alright, so this is it. There is no content. There are no menus besides this main menu. And I'm gonna show you how to add a language. But first of all, we're interested to install the Youth in Pro. So Youth in Pro is installing. Okay, we have successful installation. Let's go select it. It's a default. Alright, so let's go and install a language. I would like to install, say, Greek. Okay, Greek language is installed. So let's see what we have here. All right, so this is the language tags. Okay, great. Content languages, we have to enable the Greek. We have to go to plugins. Enable the language filter. Depends what you want to do. You just have to decide here if you want a default language. So uh, I usually select site language, which we previously select under language options. Save and close. We go into modules and we make sure that we will have a language switcher. Usually nobody wants to show the title of this. I'll just put one here. And I'll just put toolbar. Menu assignment on all pages. This language setting has to be all. I'll save and close. So let's go and create a menu. Uh, actually, let's go create an article first. So create a new one. And Greek. I will select Greek. Save and close. I will create another one. And select its uh, language. Save and close. So you will notice we have one in English, one in Greek, but we didn't make any kind of associations between them. So this is important step to come here to association, and you're gonna select the language. So this home English is associated to home Greek. So Joomla knows which article is associated to what. And I will do the same for the Greek one. You see it's already associated. So we don't really need to do anything, okay? All right. So now let's create menu. One will be main menu in English. And 
one more. So I'm close. So at this point, nothing changes here. Okay. So we have the English main menu. We have to assign an article to it. Close. I'm just gonna show you how it works because so you can see that nothing changes here there is no flag so what we need to do basically you need to come here and you need to assign the language and you need to make it default for that language so this will be the home icon the home article for English we need to do the same for the Greek one You can also use uh, filters here in case you have uh, big content, so it will just help you filter stuff out. Yes, Greek, we save and close. So now you will notice that each language has, uh, but we're missing the association, so we have to come here we have to create this association also for the menu items so this one save and close we go to the english menu you see the association so this one is associated to the greek home gr okay let's go further on and see what happens it's very important that you leave one main menu uh, be as a home you will see this star here okay this Joomla needs it to work like this so this main menu has to be there you cannot delete it and we have these two all right so let's go to our models let's create a new one and we will want a menu okay we can assign it to I think there is a navbar position okay we need to select the proper language always remember this this is gonna help you a lot menu assignment can be on all pages even Greek and English but because of this it will filter it out so uh, main menu we have to select the English one and save and close And we're gonna create one for the Greek. And we select the Greek menu. Assignment, just check it, it's on all, save and close. Okay, great. Let's go back to our menus and now check something. Okay. Notice that this says position 7, which stayed from the previous Joomla. Okay, so let's go to manage. You see here it says linked models. So this main menu, it's the one on menu position seven. Okay, so let's just try to link them. This one is tells you that it's linked to the English one and this one is linked to the Greek one. So we have everything that we need. Let's go and check 
how it behaves now. On, uh, on our builder. Now you see here we have home, home in. This is wrong, this shouldn't be like this. If we switch to the Greek one, again it's home, home gr. So we want to avoid this main menu coming up. All right, let's go and check how we can do this. Have to close, we have to go back to the model manager. Okay, so in order to get rid of the um, this extra home here, we need to go to the builder menus, and this is the by default selected like this. So we need to make select, save, close. Okay. So now if we refresh here, this home should be gone from both of the languages. All right. 